court is back in session. I'm informed we have a verdict. Um, I know that this is a emotional issue for many of the people in, involved in this. But, uh, you know, this jury was drafted. They didn't volunteer to be here. I know they've uh, worked hard and done the best they can. I'd be very offended if anyone were to react in front of the jury. There shouldn't be any any reaction at all. Um, if you don't feel like you can abide by that, I would suggest you step out. I would be very offended if somebody acts out in front of the jury. Um, so if you don't feel like you can, with dignity, accept whatever is said by the jury, and I don't know what that is, I'll be learning about it at the same time, you would do everybody a favor and just step out. Um, we ready for a jury? Yes, Your Honor. Yes, Your Honor. All right, let's have a jury, please. We're going to have everyone stay till the jurors are off the floor. So uh, maybe one of you. All right, everybody be seated, please. Ms. Idlett, I see you with the papers in your hand, or you are a poor person. Has the jury arrived at a verdict? Would you hand it to the bailiff, please? State of Florida versus De Denise Williams. We, the jury, find as follows as to count one of the indictment. The defendant is guilty of conspiracy to commit first-degree murder. As to count two, we the jury find the defendant is guilty of first degree murder. We the jury find as follows as to count three of the indictment, the defendant is guilty of accessory after the fact of first degree murder. It's been dated and signed by the four person. Ms. Idlett, did I accurately reflect the verdict of the jury? Uh, either side wish to have the jury polled. Yes, Your Honor. All right, polling means that I need to confirm with each of you that this is your individual verdict as well as the verdict of the jury as a whole. I'll start with your number one. Is this your verdict as well as the verdict of the jury as a whole? Number two? Yes. Number three? Yes. Number four? Yes. Number five? Yes. Number six? Yes. Number seven? Yes. Number eight? Yes. Number nine? Yes, Your Honor. Number ten? Yes. Number eleven? Yes. Number twelve? Yes, sir. Jury is unanimously confirmed the verdict. It appears to be in order. It will be filed. This will conclude your service with us. We do appreciate the time and the attention that you've given us. I know this is difficult duty to come in and make decisions of this nature. It's not appropriate for a judge to comment on a verdict one way or another, so don't take my comments as that, but I do appreciate the fact you came in and worked hard, um, given us many hours of your time for that. We're appreciative. Let me make you aware of one right that you have as a juror. You have a right not to discuss your deliberations. That doesn't mean you're prohibited from talking about them. You, you can talk about them if you wish, but it is possible someone would inquire of you possible they would inquire to find fault with what you've done. You have every right to simply say, I'd prefer not to talk about it. As I say, that's your right, and if you desire to talk, you're free to do so. Um, we've taken up enough of your time, so we won't be in any long speeches. Have you made arrangements to get them safely out of the building, deputy? Uh, we'll let you step out with the deputies. Um, have the audience remain until jury's cleared the, uh, the floor. If y'all will let me know when you've cleared the floor, please. Yes, sir. All right, everybody be seated. Um, Ms. Williams remanded to custody pending sentencing in this matter. And 
the defense requests that we have a pre-sentence investigative report started? I would, Your Honor, and respectfully, is there any way we could do the case management perhaps in early January versus... Yeah, I mean, it's largely just to make sure we have a date so y'all can start on getting a sentencing date set. I'll find someone to cover for me. What's that? I apologize. I skipped something in Jacksonville, but I'll make arrangements. All right. So, and if you can communicate, Mr. Fuchs will work out a sentencing date. Yes, sir. Madam Clerk, would you order the pre-sentence investigative report be ordered, please? Yes, sir. Anything else from either side? Your Honor, may I have Ms. Wooten's presence at the December 18th case management? Certainly, certainly. We don't need her presence at the case management. We don't generally have defendants at case management, although I guess sometimes on the first degree murder cases they do. So, yeah, we'll waive her presence for them. Thank you, Your Honor. Anything else? They are. We'll be in recess.